There he is with his, um, his midget team. That's from 1939 when he was uh, 15 years old. So. Chad soon shows off a modest display dedicated to Larry Kwong at this hockey rink in Vernon. Kwong was the first hockey player from the Okanagan to make it to the NHL. It's a story soon has been championing since he met and befriended Kwong more than a decade ago. So it's just a really powerful story. It has, you know, it has all the elements of that classic hero journey. You know, it, it's just, you know, the impossible odds. Larry Kwong was born in 1923 in Vernon into a Chinese immigrant family. His parents ran a dry goods store. And like many boys, Kwong played hockey and dreamed of making it to the NHL. Fast and tenacious, he was a talented center, leading his minor hockey team to a provincial title. He was a sniper, he was a brilliant passer. He was, um, uh, he would set up behind the net like Gretzky would 30 years later and make extraordinary passes. Kwong's play caught the eye of a scout for the New York Rangers, and in 1948, as the leading scorer of his minor league team, Kwong was called up to the NHL. End of the second, Montreal 8, New York 2. Kwong sat on the bench until late in the third period when his coach put him out for one shift. But with that 60 seconds, he became the first non-white player to skate in the NHL. Kwong's NHL career was short-lived, however, as the Rangers sent him back to the minors shortly after the game. Larry left the team knowing that the chance it, that the league just wasn't ready for, for him, for a player that looked like him. Um, it was, you know, hockey was, had long been known as a white man's game, and Larry just didn't fit the image of that. Now, soon is part of a push to have Kwong inducted into the 2023 class of the Hockey Hall of Fame as a builder for breaking racial barriers and also growing hockey in Europe, where Kwong coached and played for more than a decade. Kwong died in 2018 in Calgary when he was 94, little recognized for his achievement. Larry's story needs to be amplified, and, and rightfully so, he deserves to be in the Hockey Hall of Fame. We're also going to do some turning today. Moisine Hasham works with immigrant children, giving them opportunities to play hockey. He says having role models like Kwong recognized at the highest levels is important to diversify the sport and make hockey something all Canadian kids can see themselves playing. We want them to understand that there are people that look like them that did play the game at the highest levels. Soon in Hisham hope the timing is right for this bid to the Hockey Hall of Fame as next year marks 75 years since Larry Kwong made hockey history. Keep smiling. <laughs> Brady Strachan, CBC News, Vernon.